On March 25th, we observe the International Day of Remembrance of the Victims of Slavery and the Transatlantic Slave Trade. The United Nations designated this international observance in 2007 to honor and remember those who suffered and died as a consequence of the transatlantic slave trade. The theme for this year's observance is Fighting Slavery's Legacy of Racism Through Transformative Education. And on March 27th, the Lutheran Office for World Community will join the United Nations General Assembly to commemorate the day. For over 400 years, more than 15 million men, women, and children were victims of the slave trade, which has been called the worst violation of human rights in history. There is still so little that we know about the stories of these 15 million brothers and sisters torn from their homes. But there are stories behind every fact and figure, human stories that must be told, stories of suffering and pain, families being ripped apart and of being beaten and bound, abused and forced into servitude. But there are also stories of awe-inspiring resistance and hope slowly building towards revolution and freedom. We must recount these stories of our historical truth. This is how we begin to address the legacy of slavery that continues to blight our present-day racism. We join the United Nations, the Global Ecumenical Family, and the Lutheran World Federation in engaging in work to address the enduring legacy of racism in the United States and globally as part of the United Nations International Decade for People of African Descent, 2015 to 2024. Let us pray. Holy and righteous God, you created us in your image. Grant us grace to contend fearlessly against evil and to make no peace with oppression. Help us like those of generations before us who resisted the evil of slavery and human bondage in any form and any manner of oppression. Help us to use our freedoms to bring justice among people and nations everywhere to the glory of your holy name through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen.